I'm Dynasty coming to you live from uh, my basement. Uh, anyhow, uh, this is about America. This is about real estate. This is about financing. None of this is financial advice. <laughs> and, and you shouldn't need to hear that because you could, should easily come up with your own conclusions as soon as you hear this. Uh, don't, don't buy any houses in Las Vegas area, Nevada, or Arizona. Once the water from Lake Mead gets down like 920 foot, water stops pumping to those places and it flows into California. You think I'm lying? I am not. Here we go. And I did do some research on this hole that was supposedly drilled in the bottom of Lake Mead. It sounds kind of nefarious when you, you think about it, but I did do some research, and sure enough, there was a, a hole many years ago, back in 2015, a, a large 24-foot diameter hole. And inside this hole, there's a, a large pipeline that runs from one of the deepest locations in Lake Mead. And the objective of this very large tunnel and pipeline that was positioned in the bottom of Lake Mead is called the third straw. It's an intake valve that delivers water to Las Vegas. Las Vegas relies on Lake Mead for 90% of its water. And Lake Mead right now is operating at 27% capacity and falling. It's not even anywhere near 100%. It's not even close to 50%. And we have millions of people depending on this body of water right here. And the water rights are as follows. If it gets down below 900, the power plant would no longer work and, and water rights would go into effect. From what I understand, even with the implementation of this new massive intake valve that's positioned at the deepest part of Lake Mead, and this project was finished back in 2015, so it's been a few years since there was indeed a hole drilled in the bottom of Lake Mead, but if this number gets down to 900, water rights would go into effect. Las Vegas, from what I understand, would lose water rights first, then Arizona, and the water would remain flowing. What's left in the Colorado River would continue to flow into California. So, All right, just a quick little update, some financial advice and uh, some uh, real estate advice. Uh, don't buy in those areas. They're going to run out of water even if it starts raining real heavy right now. And doesn't stop for 39 days, then it gives us a day break and then rains for another 39 days. It's not enough. They project Lake Mead will ne never be refilled. And with Las Vegas and Arizona growing in number of people, that just means they're pulling more and more water. Which means the likelihood, mathematically, of it reaching the 900 foot level is more likely than it not. Make your own decisions off of this. Have a great day. Enjoy life.